just lots of things to do. Yeah. Uh, Zoya is getting ready to go across the world again because that's what she does. <laughs> And then I am going back and forth. You got like a fly, I guess, an ant on your ship. And that's a first for the show. And uh, thankful for people who are good to you. Mm -hmm. Because then they're inadvertently good to me. Yes. Whether or not they know me or mm -hmm. whatever, they make my life a little nicer. It's so funny when I do talk about you, everyone, all my clients are like, he's so cute. It's so nice. Mm -mm. You know? Yeah. Like, mm, well. I'll give them nice. I could be nice. Yeah. Especially if I like you. Yes. And I like all of your clients. <laughs> you like all of them? Yes. That's not sarcasm. What? For the brief Call moments? Call back to last week. Yeah, I haven't met most of your mm. most of the people that you work with. Yeah, and that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I give you a lot of credit, man. You got to be in such close quarters with people. You got to be up in it. Yeah. Like like physically and like conversation wise. Yeah. It's hard sometimes. You're like at the mercy of whatever they You're like on a little podcast you didn't choose to be on all day and you can't go nowhere yeah, and you're nowhere's. working the whole time got nowhere huh. um yeah it's interesting it's definitely an interesting dynamic it's yeah it's interesting For, that's all i can say what's the longest you have been with one person Oh, you didn't like, like. <laughs> oh, that I didn't like, I don't know, a couple of hours. I mean, the longest I've ever been with someone. Oh, well, I, in the beginning of my career, there was a girl who was very sick with Crohn's and she ended up being in the hospital for months at a time. <clears throat> I had to have several feet of her intestines removed and she was just laid up, couldn't move. Damn, couldn't dude. do anything and you thought this person was annoying as fuck no you're kind of a bad no this no, is back no. to zoe is kind of a bad friend yeah hmm. yikes so <laughs> she ended up ha having her hair matted you know yeah. so like she couldn't get like this huge knot it was like just one huge dreadlock damn dude and i worked on her for like two days straight i think i've told this story before mm-hmm and I worked on her for two days straight. Literally everything I did, I could not get this thing out. And I tried and tried and tried. What do you do? I mean, there's a lot of conditioner that happens. And... And she didn't want to cut it? No. She really wanted to salvage it, but we couldn't. Damn. I tried, you know. What? I mean, it was so matted. Like, it was like an inch, like, away from her head. Damn. We just gave her, like, a pixie... Um, it was really cute when we, once we cut it off. I think she was just so scared of like what she would look like after all of this stuff, and she was just so sick and couldn't get out of her head at the way she already looked. Right. Because of all of the surgeries and all the things that she didn't want, you know, she had long, beautiful, curly hair, and it just wasn't going to be that right away. Right. But we gave her a really cute haircut. So that was the longest you've ever been with somebody. Yeah, two days straight. In I general, mean, yeah. that's all of. I mean, out of all your clients, what was the longest you've ever been with somebody that is that you would consider really annoying? <laughs> I mean, I've spent like four or five hours with people that are slightly annoying, you know. But the longest, like recently, was probably like eight or nine hours. Right. Ten hours. Damn. Mm -hmm. One day. Yeah, it depends on what they're like. I mean, that's always for like a huge color correction, whatever, when you're taking somebody from. I posted a redhead that I recently did. It's a very like coppery red light. Um, we spent eight hours together that day, and she was like a really dark, deep red. And you thought that she was annoying? No, I think she's <laughs> lovely. No, I love her. I do. I do her and her parents and her brother and just, and just her sister. You know, yeah. I do the whole family. I'm just trying to start yeah. shit with you and your clients. No. I think you got to, I, th I don't think you're, I think you got some time in your schedule for you to spice it up a little bit. Yeah. Just start shit. So I'm going to start a feud. I'm going to write some 
conflicts for you and your clients. Yeah. I'm going to uh, DM that redhead and be like, you hear what Zoe said about you and welcome to our podcast? Did you hear what she said? What the hell? No, she's lovely. I love her. All right. Well, yeah. instigating over. Well. Zoe. Mike. Um, You came to my, to my uh, show last night. Mm-hmm. I did five minutes before this show called uh, Culture Core. Yes. Uh, in the belly room at the comedy store. And it happens, I think, once a month. And they take uh, beefs in the comedy community and mm-hmm. they play it out like a uh, people's court. Yes. It's very funny. Yes. Matt Lockwood. Yes. And uh, Keith Johnson mm-hmm. and Rob Smallwood. Mm-hmm. And they're great. Yes. And it's so much fun. It and was they let fun. let me uh, do a set before their show. And you saw it. What do you think? I thought the show was really good. I spent a little too much time on the first case. Hmm. But all in all, they, I think they I think those are funny boys. I think they're very funny boys. And uh, You're talking about my friends in the yes. culture court right now. And they did a great job. Yes. And no one is... Yes. No one is... Denying that, right? And then, and you there caught my set really before him. Funny comedians prior to the show. Yes, there was one guy with long hair that I was just like, man, he's all right. Mm. I'm trying to think who else was on the show. Trey Stewart doesn't have long hair. No, no. Cole Garrett doesn't have. No, what long was her hair. name? Nikki Bond Nikki has Bond kind of long hair. Very and you funny. thought Nikki Bond was mad. I thought she was very Because I think funny. she's fun as fuck. Yeah, she was fun. She was so very you're not funny. talking about Nikki? No, 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 no. She was great. I think she was my favorite of the night. Hmm. Hmm. And anyone else in the, fir- in the, in the first couple of people? I don't know. It got really hot in there, and I needed to get out. Yes, and that's when the point. other guy came up, the one with the beard. And then I noticed it getting hotter as well. <laughs> what do you think? You have to rotten tomatoes in. Yeah. Never mind.